So the first guy I'd like to introduce, I think audiences enjoy because everyone knows someone like this in your own family or where you work. Please help me welcome my old friend, Walter. Walter, uh, how are you? What the hell do you think? Well, uh, you playing it safe with the mask? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I'm about to die, though. Why? I picked up the wrong damn mask. You did? Yeah, this is yours and your breath stinks. <laughs> Can I take it off? Please do, and then get yourself a damn Tic Tac, for God's sakes. <laughs> How's everything else? Oh, it's just great. This has been the best year ever. <laughs> but then, after all these months, you told me we were gonna finally get to do a show again. That's right. I was happy. Really? Yeah. Then we get here and we're outdoors. <laughs> and the size of this audience makes it look like we're doing a freaking barnitza <laughs> for one of the unpopular kids. <laughs> This sucks. But we're outdoors. I know. Do a show. Get a tick. <laughs> this is a lovely place for a birthday party. <laughs> hey, let's go play pin the tail on the moron who decided to do this. <laughs> Walter, we're here to make people laugh. Yeah, well, and we're in the middle of the terrible pandemic, so let's have a chuckle. <laughs> People could use a laugh right now. I could use some crack right now. <laughs> well, outside, yeah, no walls, right? No curtain, yeah. This is Comedy Central on a budget. <laughs> this is a great venue. You have been quarantined too damn long. <laughs> well, this looks like the patrons had nowhere to go after a Chuck E. Cheese burnt down. <laughs> so what have you been doing all this time off? Well, uh, actually, I had my hips replaced. Your hips? Both knees? Really? Yeah. Had my shoulder replaced? I had no idea. Yeah. I'm trying to get out of my marriage one body part at a time. <laughs> so you think this is great being on TV? I don't care. My wife and I have been locked up alone in our house together for so long, it's just a matter of time before we end up on Dateline. <laughs> How have you been holding up through all this? Well, I just hope you washed your hand for 20 seconds before you put it where it is. <laughs> and aren't we supposed to be six feet apart? Well, oh, wait, yeah, if we did that, I couldn't talk. <laughs> You can't throw your voice in measly six feet? Yes, I can. Oh, but I guess my mouth wouldn't move. Because you couldn't pull on the little thing of the jig back there. You'd be like, hey, Walter, and I'd be like, hey, Lauren, how's it going? <laughs> mask when you go to the store and all that? Sure. I like the idiots who wear masks over their mouths, but not their noses, too. Dimwits. That's like wearing a jock strap on your knees. <laughs> I mean, it's there, but what's the point? You know, I read that medical experts say people should wear masks during time of, you know, ah, come on, you don't need a mask. No, no. You can hold your breath for 34 seconds. 